what is crackalackin everyone welcome back to the channel and welcome to the finale review of wandavision and i'm gonna start with that this episode was an excellent excellent last episode to just end it all it has enough teases on what to come uh what can we expect from the future of the mcu and it had enough heart within the episode itself that it just, just, just was so good. Uh, I mean, it went on all cylinders. I mean, it went full force. It came at you. Uh, the battle itself was amazing. I'm going to start with the visuals in this one was nothing short of a big action movie finale. This was it. You can tell the Disney uh, money uh, coming to play here because visually it was just beautiful. Uh, it didn't feel like there was wonky CGI here and there. I mean, if you really look really hard, maybe there are a few moments you can really like kind of nitpick but overall it was just a fantastic uh finale fight and again no spoilers if you've seen the last episode you know the vision fight was amazing uh and the wanda uh fight was absolutely spectacular and there's something that happens with wanda Finally, uh, it is very, very, very well done. Um, obviously, as far as like revelations in terms of what with Vision and what's with Wanda, uh, there's not too much with Vision, but there is also something with Vision. I'll let you watch the episode to figure that out. I'm going to stay away from the spoilers. Uh, and when obviously with Wanda, we finally get that big scarlet which moment it was spectacular uh and you know the supporting cast was there uh, that maybe is a nitpick that might be there with some people that the supporting cast could have been used a bit more certain characters and there is one particular character that i think a lot of people are gonna have a problem with um, it was built up, but at the end of the day, I do think for now, for now, it was the right decision to keep it that way. Uh, I don't think it would have been a good idea for this character to have a revelation of its own because I do think if that happened, it would have taken away from everything else that was happening in the episode there was enough emotion there there were emotional moments uh there was a story at play a story that had to end the story that started in episode one and which was wanda vision it had to end in its proper way so i do think that if a lot of the other elements that i think we all wanted happen it would have taken away from the episode and at the end of the day i think we wanted it we wanted something else but at the same time i don't think we needed it so it is a good thing that they went that way that they kept a lot of hints in there and there are actually two Two post credit scene. There's a mid credit scene. There's a post credit scene, and there's stuff there that sets up. And I do even think that with that third character, uh, it's not over yet. I don't think it's over. I do think there is a bigger story at play. Otherwise, that character with that actor, he he wouldn't be there. It just does not make sense for that actor to appear in this if it was not for nothing. So. It was a smart decision to not involve all of those elements where there's a bigger story at play. So I loved that they did that. 
I love that they were focused. Uh, they stayed true to Wanda's character, true to Vision's character, and what they were going for. Uh, the finale was full on in your face. It did not hold back. The action was really, really, really good. Uh, the visuals were really good. So overall, I give this episode a 9.5 out of 10. Uh, again, I would have loved uh, some characters to be involved a bit more. Uh, they were just not there. But at the same time, I do understand that there was just so much happening. And when you watch this episode, you'll see there is just so much happening in the episode that it just the this episode would have been needed to be like an hour or hour and a half at least you know, in that time range for the all those characters uh, to be at play. So again, there is a story that ends, but I do think there are a lot of elements and characters that did just leave them open to be for now. And then we'll see what happens in the coming future. So it was a smart decision. I do think it was very smart for them the way they did it. Uh, as I said, Yes, we wanted certain things to happen, but I don't think we needed them. So that is my take on this episode. I tried to stay away from the spoilers as much, but again, certain things I did have to mention. So what did you think about this episode? Did you like it? Did it meet your expectations or not at all? Or you just thought, yeah, it was great. It was not perfect. It was not good, but it was great. You leave a comment below. Let me know. And other than that, I'll say thank you for watching. Thanks for all the support. And yeah, take it easy. Take care. And I will catch you all later. Until then, ta-ta. Ikke out.